Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. friendly as it can be in the circumstances but you feel the rivalry well in games of this nature as a player Peter you only want to work as hard as demanded you don't want to have to go at it full pelt but when the opposition is what it is all of that kind of goes out the window the challenge here will ask more of you and so both teams will will wish to to give more than they take it's one of those games Peter where if the opposition increase their effort you have to follow it. So off we go then. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Luis Suarez. He can score from anywhere, Peter. He's capable of the sublime, but he's also not afraid to use his physical attributes to dominate defenders or to scrap for those loose balls. He's got so much will to win, that's bound to inspire his new teammates and, hopefully for him, intimidate his opposition. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. over to the other flank. Isco, well positioned to make that interception. PK. Modric gets it back. Madrid are seeing a lot of the ball early on, but can they make it tell? Casemiro goes back to base. Across the field it goes. And it's Isco. Kroos gets into a good position. Kroos looking to get on the end of this. Can he shoot? And the finish! Tries to get it clear. And here's Ka Chance! Oh, that's a fine save! Casemiro sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos switches it to the other side. Tony Kroos. Modric tries to switch the play. Messi. Kroos battles to win it back. Barcelona are working the ball as only they can. Yeah, Peter, and it's a style that requires players of high-caliber technique to move the ball about quickly in tight areas.
Modric. Luis Suarez. Breaks on here. Rakitic. He's made sure that that won't get through. Now it's Bale. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Roberto. He goes long. Corner then. Clearance, but not much of one. Arthur gets it into the middle. Oh, the clearance is short. Keep defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire a commitment like that. Because... It's going to be the final action of the first half. So the other team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Reflections on the first half? Yeah, and despite the scoreline, it's clear who the better side is when it comes to chances. If this is the trend that's going to continue, then there's only going to be one winner here, and uh, I don't think it's going to take too much improvement for it to happen. After 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. So, we're just settling back into this second half. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully, they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. Looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Now it's Griezmann. Well, they could break here. And it... Roberto. Still absolutely nothing to report here, goals-wise. Modric, forward it goes. Fence has got rid of that. Ah, oh, now can they counter? Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection on what Messi has been caught there. It's a foul. A fine save. Well, I thought a starting position was good, and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Madrid going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Modric. Casemiro. Modric. Plays it over to the other flank. Marcelo has brushed off the ball there. Messi has a look up from the right-hand side, seeking out options. Tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Modric plays it forward. 
And it's Benzema. Chance to shoot. Modric knocks it in gently. PK can get it clear. That's great strength on the ball. Gets good distance on it. Griezmann. Can he deliver? Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. And here's Suarez. Now yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. a bit special Barcelona take the lead, now it's just a question of holding on. Well, look, Peter, I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another, so we can't be too presumptuous yet. This goal plays it long. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Hoists it forward. Sergio Ramos. And that's it. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal is enough. Narrowly beaten. The end of the game. Reflections. And we 